One more thing that I can do to, to add a bit more detail, I was thinking about the, the feet. Um, before I do that, I'm just going to pop my head layers into a new group, and let's call that the head group. There we go, head. Uh, and let's just zoom in on, on the feet, because when we did the feet, we added the, this section, which was um, sort of the ankle. So let's look at the left leg in a bit more detail. And let's go right. So it's just the foot and the ankle. So if I hide the ankle, can you see how these sections would actually be in front of the ankle? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just select the ankle there. I'm going to zoom in even closer, actually. And I'm going to drop its opacity down so I can see the object or the details of the foot section in front of it. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to just select my eraser tool and make this really small. In fact, even maybe just two pixel size. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to erase, and let's just make the hardness 100 because I want a very sharp edge. I'm going to erase parts of okay. So I'm on the ankle there, so I'm rubbing out parts of the ankle. So I'm rubbing out there. So when I take the opacity, can you see how I'm just rubbing out there? I take the opacity on the anchor layer back up. You see how now this looks as if it's in front. Okay, let's take the opacity down. Because I just need to be able to see the detail of the edges of this object. So again, it's, so I'm using the the edges of the, the foot detail as a reference point. And I'm just erasing inside that section. It's quite difficult to see, but that should be doing that nicely. And again up here, all the way up to that edge and down inside so that when I bring up opacity again detail is looking like it's inside okay and this is actually part of the the foot section so let's just delete here to it's just a small bit of detail, but it's adding an extra bit of believability to my robot. Okay, so there we go. And then I would do the same thing on my right leg, just to, to, um, to add the detail onto there. There may well be other sections of my robot where I could do a similar kind of thing, but I'm going to leave it at that. The last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put all of my layers and groups into a completely new group, a single group called Robot. And the reason I'm doing that, that is for the next tutorial, which is about putting my robot onto a photographic background.